My name is David Burley. I am the director of marketing for Overdrive. Uh -huh. Overdrive is a global distributor of ebooks, audiobooks, music, and video that we're supplying to libraries, schools, and retailers around the world. And have you had a successful show here at CES? So we far? have had a successful show here at CES. It's been great. It's day two, and we've had a very consistent traffic flow of retailers, device OEMs, um, librarians, people from all over interested in ebooks. Have there been a lot of um, publishers and content industry people that you've been meeting with here? Not really. It's not so much about the content here as it would be at Book Expo or London Book Fair, Frankfurt, that, that kind of show. Here it's more about manufacturers, retailers, traditional booksellers, non-traditional booksellers, people who want to get into the bookselling business with ebooks and audiobooks and other digital media. And how is that relevant for Overdrive? It's relevant for Overdrive in that we can supply them with the ebooks and audiobooks that they're looking to sell on their sites. We can build a website for them, we can just give them the feed, we can build an app or we can give them the API and they can integrate it into their device. There's a lot of different ways that we can set them up to sell ebooks. We are also uh, just announced this week the new apps that we've developed for iPhone and Android. We have iPad coming soon that have integrated ebook and audiobook reading and listening uh, right there on the device. These are these are apps that you can use to download books from the library. And have you made any agreements or anything with any of the any of the device makers here? We're talking with just about everybody here. To um, you know, nothing I can say publicly um, that we are talking about uh, integrating either apps or providing the APIs or building stores or all of the above. Um, lots of different things that we're talking about. And do you think publishers are going to start coming to CES more? Publishers certainly can benefit by being here, by looking at all the devices that are out there. Um, as the middleman, I think we're a good representative for them, as we do have relationships with those publishers, um, to help them you know, figure out what are the devices that are out there, what's the best platform to be on. But we can serve that purpose of being the integrator for them to make sure that their content and uh, you know, copyrighted material gets onto as many devices as possible. Um, I think at this point we see both tablets and dedicated e-readers as viable options for publishers to get their material on. I don't know that there's a clear cut um, winner in that space, but we're seeing a lot of tablets here at CES this year. There were a lot of e-readers last year, dedicated e-readers, and I think there's going to be a few that, that make it all the way through. We work very closely with Sony, for example, who has a great product in the Sony uh, e-reader. Um, and also on the tablets, uh, it's, um, there's lots of devices that as long as they work with the Adobe software, um, we can create apps for them and, and they can be downloaded directly to those devices or they can be sideloaded from their PC or Mac. Okay. And this is a bit off topic, but what do you think about lending ebooks through libraries? Lending ebooks from libraries is a, is a good business for publishers. What the, what the thing is that most publishers don't really realize is that a lot of the traffic that goes to libraries online really walks away empty-handed, and so that they are it's a great place for discovery, marketability, merchandising of their authors, their titles, um, their ebooks, their audiobooks, and other materials. So that is a great opportunity for them to market, and then they will go out and buy the book at other places. But libraries, just as they've served the role in the print world, they're serving that same role in the digital world for discoverability and exposure for their titles. We saw a lot of traffic increases, a huge traffic increases over Christmas, over the last couple of weeks, because of all these new devices, a lot of new awareness that, that you can borrow books from the library and put them on your devices. So um, we've seen um, big increases in traffic, big increases in circulation at all of our libraries. Are you coming back next year to CES? We are coming back here to CES next year. We'll be here and we'll probably be with a lot of the ebook devices and whatever the latest and greatest thing is going to be next year. Even since last year, things have changed from the ebook readers and the, uh, to this year, it's all about the tablets and we'll see what it's all about next year.